Hello. It is so good to be together. Now, before we tell our story, I'm going to light our candle. For there was once someone who did such amazing things and said such wonderful things that people began to follow him. And one time they asked him, who are you? And he responded, I am the light. So we light a candle when we gather or when we're alone, when we talk about Jesus and when we need to be reminded of the light that he shines in us and around us. Now, the story that we're talking about today happened a long time before Jesus lived. The world was rebuilding itself after a great flood. And some decided to build a city with a tall tower. They wanted the tower to reach all the way to the heavens. Now, I've tried to build a little tower here from objects I have around the home. What do you think of it? I wonder if you can build a tower with any of the toys or boxes or things that you have around. The tower in the story can be a symbol for focusing too much on ourselves and not enough on others. For the people who were building the tower were doing it to show how great they were. So what happened was that God actually came down to the tower and said, stop building this tower and instead scatter across the land and the world with a variety of different languages. So that's what people did. And it could be why there are different languages that are spread all over the world. But I wonder, if we were to take down the towers we build in our lives, so that can be anything that's kind of selfish, and instead scatter messages around the world, what would we scatter? Well, I've turned some of my tower into some messages to scatter. I wonder what they are. Kindness. Joy, love, faith, service, and laughter. What would you scatter to make the world a little bit better? Let's pray. God, thank you for the diversity of the world. Thank you for all the things that make us different from others. And thank you for helping us to love all of those differences. Amen.